and welcome to our presentation today, What is Hybrid Cloud Storage? I'm George Crump, Chief Steward at Steward Switzerland, and I'll be taking you through today's presentation. Storage Switzerland is an analyst firm focused on storage, virtualization, and cloud computing. We gain knowledge of these markets via briefings, testing lab, and decades of real-world experience. Our findings are put into various articles, reports, and screencasts like this. You can find all that information at the website below, storage-switzerland.com. We also have uh, blogs that are, appear uh, every other day on Information Week and Bite and Switch. And then we're available for free consultation to uh, IT professionals. So what is cloud storage? Uh, before we get into what is a hybrid cloud, we have to look at what is cloud storage. And essentially, cloud storage is uh, storage connected somewhere on the, on the Internet. And so we have a bunch of users at, at home locations or, or small offices. They're connected in, and they're using uh, these um, cloud storage service providers that do a couple of things. Number one, they might be using it for backup. Uh, very common now to see backup applications uh, throughout the, the um, cloud storage uh, market. And then secondly, file sharing. Uh, obviously, we see a lot of file sharing type of activity going on in the market today. Uh, simplest example is photos, but uh, we're also seeing a lot of collaboration type of uh, providers and, and companies of that nature. But as the business grows, we start moving these small offices into single locations. And instead of a uh, multiple hooks into the internet, we have one hook. We probably put uh, a single file server in place with a, uh, with a wide area connection into the internet. As the environment uh, sits like this, we'll have a couple of use cases very similar to the last one, um, typically pretty practical for backup and then also for collaboration. But as the environment uh, grows and the, and the businesses get larger, now we need to start looking at how we handle growth within the small business. So we might add a few file servers. Uh, maybe some application servers. We might add uh, another platform like Unix. We might get into virtualization and start virtualizing servers. So all of that might uh, start to really uh, impact how we can use the cloud. Uh, now we start to have a bottleneck and, and uh, really get some concerns to worry about, like how do we archive data into this? How do we take care of application backup into the cloud? And then finally, how do we handle restores? Also, of course, is how do we handle service outages, uh, either on your end or your provider's end or somewhere in between. Uh, almost weekly, we hear of some sort of major disconnect from one of the major pro uh, providers. And then, of course, we just finally may have performance issues. There may be too much data to send through the cloud. So the way to uh, eliminate uh, these issues, we believe, is to go to something that we that is more of a hybrid model and we call that the hybrid cloud and it essentially is an appliance with a little bit of storage and it basically acts as a cache to the uh, cloud uh, infrastructure uh, so that takes care of being able to do archive we can cache things locally and then trickle it up into the uh, to the cloud provider it takes care of application backup we can put some intelligence on the appliance to handle hot backup of exchange and oracle and things like that and then finally, it also handles uh, restores because now the most active copy of data is kept locally so that when we need to do an emergency full system recovery, we can simply copy the data off of the local drive. And then the cloud provider really becomes more of a um, repository for long-term retention and things of that nature. So th these solutions really help in deploying uh, cloud into larger and larger businesses and, and so we think hybrid cloud is one of the best stepping stones to get there. So the great advantage of hybrid deployment is it keeps your critical information close and safe in the cloud. So you have your most recent copies locally for immediate access and then long-term storage in case of DR or uh, archive needs are stored up in the cloud for cloud storage. Thank you very much for your time today. I appreciate you listening to this presentation, and if you have any further questions, please email us at info at storageswitzerland.com.